suddenly you get a kill. Big amounts of damage. And Oduamne perhaps to take the lead of this game as well. Jesus is going to have to watch himself. Barrel is going to pinball him back towards the wrong tower, but Odo has to be careful as he's low on the health bars. Yanko's coming in. This is about as easy as it can get. He's stunned up on the cocoon. Justice punches his way oh, in the for first, first blood. blood onto Oduamne. Jisoo goes down, but hashtag worth. You said easy. Okay, the box, it's not going to clip him here, but they're looking for nuclear. Turning their attention over to Che as Llama Bear takes a bite out of his health bar. One more shot to taste his fear and all of a sudden the monkey's got two kills well, we just to make sure jisoo was going to get killed and all of a sudden it looks like we're in for some more up goes this Ooh. spider and cos q says not today you know how we were talking about uh cos q and punch he's got flash see if he can do it Shielded Durand isn't going to get him out of harm's way but the flash will sends a winds of war he's going really low under tower here but febivin is able to finally finish him off not without well, here comes Galio into mid lane though. Cause Q hanging tough as he dodges out half the rest of Febivin, who gets Ooh. taunted up, but Cause Q very low, and Llama Bear comes in for cleanup duty, his second kill of the game. Yeah, Llama Bear able to get right in time to do so, but Rift Herald is the fight here. Talk Galio comes in. They, they just come in and eat H2K's lunch. Down it goes. That's going to be Rift Herald picked up. The fight is on as Cause Q is trying to get out of harm's way, dodging out from the spider. Dreams is going to get the flash lantern to keep Cause you alive. Nobody goes down but the Rift Herald and mysterious monkeys uh -oh. commit grand larceny, but they might pay for it here. Stunned up, Jisoo's able to take down Che. Dreams still hanging Yuki's top here. before Yanko sinks the fangs in. Yuki picking up one more kill off the back. It is one for two, mysterious monkeys. Well, that's one way of not losing tempo. Oh, cause oh Q, Yanko oh is hey, still oh. dodged. Yankos yeah, yeah. has got to protect the uh, the dodge back on the Q. Cos Q. Oh, he got the hit! Right here, he has the dash, he has the flash, he has the barrier. Will he need all three to get out? Meanwhile, Cos Q is getting chunked out by Yankos, but Yuki comes in to pick up Febivin, and Cos Q lives again! The man is a magician! Can you believe it? Cos Q for a couple of fights back to back, not giving over any gold to the enemies on the kill. So at this point, Oh, Odo gets taunted back in. He's trying to use everything. Team, this is going to be the startup, but will this dragon be the bait? Jisoo coming around the backside. Oh, good Cos Q gets caught on the cocoon. All of a sudden, it's 5v4, and it's going to look like Dreams is knocked right into the rest of the team. In comes the hero's entrance. Dreams is walking away from this one. They're turning it around, but Shea picks up a quick double on the back as Jankos is caught in the back of the pit. Febivin's going to send a big calling flying, and finally, Jisoo will fall. Shut down by Febivin. As the dust settles, Febberman and Nuclear in this mid lane have a lot of damage, but Cos Q TP'd in! He comes right uh -oh. around the side, but he falls again. He was pushing his luck that time around. So many escapes. I have never seen anyone uh -oh. go in on four members like that. But he gets pinballed once again as Che gets the kill. Jisoo is too late to be a hero. Has to take the lantern out, but they do catch up Odawamne, playing him right back into the box, and tower shots flying Ooh. right now. He's still gonna stay alive. Jason, you can't challenge us with all of your summoners being down. Look how fast they've been through a double blade of the Ruin King plus the Elise Jisoo. He can get vision, but it's not going to be too much more than that. The Baron has already gone. Way of H2K. Cos Q hunting right now, but he's locked oh, up and the again. collapse comes in. That Zanias is not going to save you too long, but he bopped right into nuclear. And in comes Jisoo. Oh no. Looks like he just tagged his way into his own doom as he has to take the blast. Tough once again, no more minions for H2K, but they got five members strong looking for Yuki, has to flash out. And the Thresh Box is there, stunning, locking up the Lucian. He flashes back right into the redemption to stay alive as even Che picks up a kill. And the Coling comes out, low health bars on the side of Mysterious Monkeys, but Koskyu is trying to play the hero, but how many times have we seen this one? He's down and out, 11 to 10 on the kills. It's been a bloody game, but H2K are looking to put a lid on it. Yeah, H2K, it's only a small minion wave but with 280 carries. Bear and the rest of Mysterious Monkey's gonna go back. There we go, one big shutdown. Finally, Yuki's gonna fall. Yanko's even sinking the fangs in with low health bars, and Llama Bear, all by his own, is not gonna be able to do it. No more minions, so H2K can't finish the barrier, but H2K just don't seem to care right now. There's the leap, oh. but they knock him right in, and they knock him right back. That's gonna be the last of the Nexus turrets. And H2K say no monkey business, not in game one, as they take a 1-0 lead on the series. It was a good start out of Mysterious Monkeys, some crisp play early on, punishing H2K. The old school bully lane that they need to just unlock them. When they try and bait Jisoo in, there's the two of used. Yankos is coming topside. Justice Punch, Flash, Cocoon, and that's a first blood. Yankos turning it right again. Ah, uh, that's how you get a little bit baited. Two 
Out of the brushes comes death, and here we go. Justice punch in, sink the fangs. Yankos claims another. Uh, this time it's H2K turning their attention to Jizu to say welcome to the L. Shen was banned, the Fiora was banned. Unfortunately, Flash Torn means Cassiopeia. Does Stun get the doesn't gaze mean off. anything. Unfortunately, no follow-up of an available yeah. thing. Lama Band jumps in. Looks for Yankos, plays back. The blue buff is secured in all of the craziness as Yuki gets found by Nuclear and stopped by Che. In comes the Galio to turn things once again. Llama Bear, he thought he was getting a kill, but instead the Hunter becomes the Hunted. Dreams falling. Two kills for the Lucian and one for Febivin. HCK just keep on eating it, but they like to play the neutral game as Febivin was a little caught out trying to play it himself, and he might go down a big investment, but the monkeys get a kill. Ah, uh, a little bit of a taste of some skill. That's what I want to see a little bit more from Feverman showcasing in games. Jisoo would take a while to die in the top lane. Yeah, this is pretty mechanical <laughs> as well. Just keep on winding it. <laughs> Jisoo's still tanking. Still they alive. actually let him get away, but uh, he's going the wrong way. So that's going to be Feverman's kill. Yeah. There you go. He's got it. He's going to smite see, but look how far away he is. He's been... Distracted, there's a taunt available. Lama Bear can't even jump in yet. Oh, and Dreams just goes down. Talk about insult to injury. He's gonna try to go in with the submarine. He's not gonna do it, Yankos. This time, it's the right smite. And now, Jisoo, it was a one way trip, but he is trying to keep himself alive, flashing over the wall back into the rest of the team. Everything they need, and they're looking for a new pair of snakeskin boots. Not gonna get it just yet. Here we go, stunned up on both sides. Yankos, he doesn't even mind his dreams is getting taken out. Nuclear on a rampage. Teleport coming in for Jisoo, but it might be too little. It might be too late. He gets a two-man taunt, but it doesn't matter. Cleansed on out. Yuki picking up Feminine on the back half of it all, but it's not gonna mean a damn thing as Llama Bear is left to try and clean up the mess, but there's nothing doing. Yeah, at this point, Mysterious. But it's difficult. They did manage to catch Febivin. He had to cleanse up and available. Didn't need to use it right there, it looked like. And they are going to be able to just melt through health bars. Dreams will be the first to fall, followed shortly by Llama Bear. And Koskyu, pop down, double kill for Nuclear. Jisoo looks to be next. And they're going to teleport in right behind Yuki. And there is nowhere to go. Oh, baby, that's a Nuclear triple. This is less Jungle Book. And H2K is saying, welcome to the now jungle. And all that's left is for them to just polish off the last of the towers. They can keep stopping Jisoo's packs for days as Nuclear. They finished the A. Off, it doesn't matter, so it's all going to be Nexus here. And H2K proved not only are they hard to kill, man, they are hella hard to beat. H2K are just styling it out to finish the job. Legendary kill for Nuclear, and that's all she wrote. GG, well played. More of the same from H2K. We, we saw them handily take down Splice in the second game, and they've done it again against Mysterious Monkeys this time. Nearly a 20,000 gold lead at the end of this second game. Mysterious Monkeys not even able to secure a tower, but I think they secured quite a lot of fans, even in defeat with the performance from always trying to fight, always trying to be aggressive, but H2K 